So we wanted to do a little talking ahead of time on this video because it's been a couple days since we trained. Mm -hmm. So we left off on the one where we forced the session. It was mm -hmm. like the last training the last session. One. Then the next day I was gone, so you were gonna just hang out with Morgan and Bond. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go get Morgan for a few minutes and we're gonna just hang out while I do some stuff in the kitchen and see how that goes. And we'll just take it from there. She didn't really want to. She kind of um, gave me the, I'm, <clears throat> sorry. Um, she kind of gave me the uh, indication that she didn't really want to step down right from the very beginning. Good job, Morgan. Good job. 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 Good job.
Come on, fly. Come on. Good girl. Wanna fly? Come on. Come on. You wanna fly? Even though Morgan is doing the desired behaviors after a while, because of the hesitation that I see and just the lack of enthusiasm overall between the two of them interacting, I feel like Morgan's saying she doesn't really want to interact that much. And I would rather work with her when she's more eager and anxious to work, more excited about it. So that's the kind of body language I like to see before starting a session. If I see language like this, I don't even have the session. So this is another session I would have called off from the very beginning. over here. So she's going, uh oh. <laughs> hey, you a little distracted by the kitty? Thanks, Nick. Good girl. business to do. Morgan, come on. I'm going to try leaving the room.
So that was the second time that I had an indication from Morgan's body language that she possibly was looking for a cue to come to me. So I just decided that I didn't want to negatively interfere with Patty's training session, and I felt like she could probably get herself out of a bad situation if it happened. So I decided to let her continue on the session solo and see how that goes, because she hasn't trained solo before. She's just been supposedly trying to bond with Morgan solo. I know what I did wrong there. Jamie? Yeah? Can you come in and help us? She's not wanting to step up for me. She's not looking for a target or for a treat. She's not wanting to step down or up? Up, step off of my hand. Okay. And she is trying to climb up my arm. And that was like that long flight was because I tried to bring her over. Over where? I started to bring her over this way and then she just took off, flew around here, went around there, and landed feet first in your basket. On the edge of it, feet first. Okay. Um, when you brought her over, were you just like, was she just on your hand here or 
Yeah, we're bringing one over to our She flew from you? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I don't want that yet. No, we don't. Okay, what would you like to do? Where do you want her? Do you want her on that counter? It doesn't. I was actually going to just keep going to debris. I had her flying around there really well. Okay. And it was going really well. Do you want her back on here? Um, It doesn't matter either, you know. Well, it you can. tell me. But yeah, go ahead. Okay. I didn't know if you had specific plans in mind. No, this is your plan. I don't want to be on the counter either. What do you want to do? Play. Play. Okay. Alright. Do you want to leave the room again? Yeah, I mean, if you want. You tell me, this is your training session. I'm kind of curious about what's going on with her, why she wouldn't step up. You want me to watch? Um. Yeah, for yeah, and okay. let's get some kind of rhythm going here. Okay, where do you want me? Wherever she, she's not going to fly you. Like, can you hide behind the couch, please, under the table? <laughs> <laughs> Anywhere where you also cannot see. Okay, I'll sit in this chair. Morgan, you want to fly? You want to fly? She signed. To me, she doesn't want to. She doesn't want to do. It. She didn't want to step off with me. I've given her a lot of variety from where I've flown her to. Mm -hmm. And so. she just doesn't seem like she wants to train. She does want. How can she not want to train? She hasn't trained for two days. Right. So you want but to want to train? That's crazy. So I'm going to take her over. I'm going to do some more positive targeting and give her a favorite flight. I don't know what else to do. Do you have a I, suggestion? I personally feel like since we brought her out, we were getting the same signals as last time of just not having a session like she just wasn't interested from the get-go this morning she just totally wanted to train she was practically you know she was all but holding up a sign was that <laughs> there's a picture there with her phone but um, <clears throat> which was that before her meal that was yeah before breakfast it was before breakfast so we could have done a session right then before breakfast all right so if but when you feel that like in the morning mm -hmm. and you're like Go oh my gosh it. she wants Yes, that's opportunistic. Right now, okay. in her phase, you kind of need to, um, what's it called, like latch onto that, like mm -hmm. take advantage of the fact that she's like, hey, I want to train, because you need that. So if you listen yeah. to her, yeah. that's respecting, like yeah. you're receiving the message, you want to train? Okay, let's go train, and you're doing it. Just, we can do that. We need to go off mm -hmm. of her, like what she tells you. Okay. You know, if you're, you right. come in and like, she's telling me that she wants to train this morning. Cool, let's do it. Okay. important that you learn to respect what she tells you so mm -hmm. if you bring her out and even though we want to train and we want to think that she wants to train she's telling us she doesn't want to oh, and wow. by her energy when she first comes out if she wants to or not right okay yeah I was hoping you were gonna call it earlier all right just read what she gives you versus what you want her to say. Okay. So I wish I would have been recording. We just had a powwow. Um, I think that next session I would like to implement those big shelled almonds for Patty to just hold a few. And when Morgan does do these awesome flights for her, just surprise the heck out of her with this giant almond. And it's what we refer to as random rewarding by using a variety of treats and sometimes they get a jackpot sometimes and this is considered a jackpot because it's a giant almond um, but I think it will blow her mind and <laughs> she won't be expecting it and 
every time she then will fly to Patty, she'll be like, is this the time I'm going to get that awesome reward? Just so an additional reinforcer. It can really just up the reinforcement for Patty to make Morgan more likely to fly there. So mm-hmm. I think we're, I think I would like you to try that. Yeah. For next time. That could be a stupid idea. When do you think we should train next? Uh, I don't think that we did very good if, before. What, if it gets like five and after, I think she's yeah. ready to, to I roost, agree. and she's going to be eating soon. Mm-hmm. So I think we're gonna have to wait till tomorrow. And I think that we're, if I get the same eagerness tomorrow morning, I will, like you said, pull her, and we'll do it in the morning. Does that make sense? Perfect answer. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> I was worried you're gonna say, "Let's try again in an hour," and I was yeah. gonna be like, "Do I tell her no?" <laughs> or do I let her fail? So I'm so excited about your answer. That is dead okay. on. Yes. Feels perfect. Thank you. Um, and anytime you feel like she's like, oh, she wants to train, have a training session. Um, what do you wish you would have done on that day off when you brought her in to like hang out? What do you wish you would have done well, if I, you could do it over? I wish that I had not involved that part of the house at all. Yeah, yeah and so I wish, brought her to a different yeah, part yeah. of the house. And I tried to put her on the tea stand. She didn't want to do that either. And mm-hmm. like you pointed out to me, it's the training stand. So it's kind of, that's not hanging out at all. And of course she's mm-hmm. going to want to train. So um, yeah, put her in a place that's not reminiscent of training mm-hmm. and where she's going to be less likely to, you know, just be focused on that. Yeah, and probably so. at a different time of day. Oh, I totally, I totally blew the time of day. Uh, time of day, and I, I kind of actually brought her out there, and I gone, oh, I thought about it's it, and I still went with it anyways. That's where you're, mm-hmm. you're still going, even though you know it's wrong. Yeah, yeah, and then I go and I put her in the counter, and when she flew to me, I'm going, oh, man, and I didn't realize that I, that was just a... You set it up Yeah, I set that it up. way. I set yeah. it just two, two strikes against me there, so it's like, okay, let's not make a third one. Yeah. Okay. So that's the perfect example. Like in your case, you accidentally set yourself up literally to fail mm-hmm. based on what you wanted to achieve. Mm-hmm. But the other way you could have done it is like it would have been great to set yourself up for success and not associated anything with training and gone to a different part of the house mm-hmm. and just like hung out. Yeah. But also she was telling you she wanted to train. So why didn't you train? Because I wasn't feeling well and I knew I was not going to do it right. I mean, I had already yeah. not been thinking clearly about that. <laughs> so <laughs> Good I mean, point. That I should have, yeah. I should have. No, the, the, the diet, the eating time should have been like right there. Mm-hmm. And it's like, I was thinking about where, what you did, you know, when you first brought her home, you set her up there and you went around and you know, you did additions, but you weren't flying her at that time. And that's, no. you know, that's she wasn't her flying. favorite spot right in there and yeah. I wasn't thinking about that either and I'd already blown it twice I wasn't going to continue and even take any chances of yeah no of course um yeah I just think the more you get used to the opportunistic training yes when she tells you yeah. and yeah. you that'll be kind of instinctive I, that'll I be good sooner than later yeah I think we're looking for that because we want her to be excited about the yeah. training so okay. we need to go off of how she's feeling and normally what I would love to see in a point that I think you'll eventually get to is you know if I if I told Dave, like, hey, go get Jinx, I want to do a training session, he would come back either with Jinx or without him. Oh, because he would go in there and say she's, he's he not would up know. to it. He yeah. would know the second he yeah. stepped him up, mm-hmm. that, just everything right. about the bird. He would know, yeah. yes, he wants to have a training session, he's going to be totally receptive, right. totally into it, or no, he does not want to train, he's not going to be receptive, it's not a good time. I'm still so learning want, Morgan. Yeah, so, I want, yeah, I know you'll eventually get there, but mm-hmm. that's a really important yep. thing. And so I'm trying to watch and see how many times she has to tell you before mm-hmm. you catch on. Yeah. And it's quite a lot right now, and hopefully yeah, you see it you know, go down. I'm still, I'm th- I was thinking, you know, well, you know, you go, I can yeah, turn, and change your mind. No, it wasn't even that. Oh. It's like we were doing that. We were. We, she hadn't trained in two days, and I. I was not trusting that. I did. I totally saw that, and I'm going. You know, I thought it was me. I'm doing something wrong. She doesn't want to come to me, but not that it didn't. That she didn't want to train, mm-hmm. and she's doing the. You know, the wings thing, and so yeah, I. You know better. I you do. Just I totally can't know. I'm not to, trusting my judgment. Yeah. Yeah. That's I, so funny. Because yeah, I, I told you about that story with Claudia, right? Which one? Um, our last day. Oh. Sunshine didn't even want to come down out of the mm-hmm. aviary. I mean, it was blatant yeah. stuff. Yeah, yes. Obviously, yeah. way more obvious than she, what you're dealing no with. No matter what, she was going out that day. Yeah. Yeah, and Claudia was just like, nope, we're going to mm-hmm. go fly. And we kept waiting and hoping and hoping she would call it. And, you know, she didn't because she didn't trust herself either. And learning to trust your 
Especially yeah. you. I know. Like, you know. <laughs> you know I more know. Than, than most people, and I feel like you need to really trust yourself. Yeah. I mean, I know you trust yourself with some of your other birds. Yeah. You know, I, I, I look to you for some of them. I'm like, oh, <laughs> what are they feeling? What are they thinking? Yeah. So, I'm trust just, yourself. Yeah. When you get those immediate signs, read it and be like, oh, this okay. is what I'm getting. you got to receive the message. Yeah. Because if you receive the message and respect it, then you're going to act on that and she's going to like that. But if you ignore it... Then I'm going to be disrespectful and not fun to be around. Yeah. Because yeah. you're definitely getting the message. You just are yeah. ignoring I'm not, it. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing with it what I should be doing with it. Yeah. Most definitely. Yeah. Yeah. So I was, I was just going to say, I was wondering, do you want to have the next session be just you and her? And I'll be working in the office or something and just call her if you need me. We could try that. Do you want to try that? Yeah. All right. But yeah, if you want to try that, because that's kind of what we tried today. Yeah. Um, half. Yeah. She was a little wigged out though that you weren't there at first, and I was thinking it was going to be a, a bad thing. Mm -hmm. And then she just bam nailed those flights. I'm going yes, good. I was so excited. So and maybe then if I just we went to hell really quickly. <laughs> 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 no, I'm just thinking maybe next time, like the next session, if we start it without me even in the room, so I'll set up the camera, set it to record, and leave, and I'll just be in the office. And you can like try have your session. Do okay. you want to try that? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm interested to see like here. I what think happens. I have a pretty good idea of what I do wrong. Mm hmm And um. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of hyper aware of a couple of things, which okay. is good. Which is good. Yeah. I would just like to see you know that initial those first that first little interaction tells you everything whether yeah. or not you should have a session or not. So just be receptive. Yep. Just be receptive. What are the things you're thinking about that you want to work on? Dumb mistakes, rookie mistakes that I'm making. You know, okay. stuff like this. So I'm very being very aware of those things. I know you talked about in the past wanting to implement the clicker. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Is that still like a future thing or is that something you want to look at implementing tomorrow? Um, let's try it and see if that doesn't have a, you know, a, a, better, a better effect, effect on it. That's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that might be that might be a, a, a very positive step. Yeah. Or not. <laughs> or you might just click it all the wrong times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just kidding. No, you did well with the treat today. That was like your number one priority and you nailed that. So I feel like if you have a number one priority going into tomorrow, yeah. what would it be? Well, if it's the clicker, it's gonna be click be uh, on the clicker at the you right think time. That's the most important thing. Um, no, no, no. Be watching her willingness to train. Obviously, just Yay. pick up on the thing that I missed today. Good. But um, if we're going to be adding something to tomorrow's session, then the clicker. Yeah, but if you just be... had one number one priority, you know how we usually go over just like one thing right before you start a session. I'm like, your number one priority today is well, like, like, what would it be for tomorrow? It will be um, observe the very first interaction when I bring her out here, and cool. you know, try to get her motivation to train in mm -hmm. my mind and respond accordingly and not disrespectfully. And yeah, no yeah. forcing sessions. No forcing se sessions. No more forcing sessions. You got two in a row, three strikes, you're out. Yeah. Just kidding. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> no pressure. No, yeah, no, I'm just kidding. Yeah, no. um, you won't have three strikes. You have a home mm -hmm. run tomorrow. Yes, I will. <laughs>